Nice. Ah. So I don't know what to do now. I'm still kind of in awe of this game. Uh, I'm still trying to get... I, I, I'm trying to grasp. E even if the game itself is not necessarily as large as an MMO or what have you. I'm st it still f has that large sort of... Uh, sh uh, it, it, that sense of a vast exploration and vast uh, amount of things to do, you know? So I'm still trying to grasp it and uh, just discern all of it and just trying to formulate a semblance of, I don't know, a semblance of, what is it, sanity? I don't know. But I'm just trying to get it all in, you know, take it all in. I'm having a lot of fun with this. Oh, look at all these people. It's it's always going to get to me, man. All these people. Watch. Watch. You. Now I'm going to sit with you. <laughs> hey, buddy. No, wh wh why did he... He did that on purpose. That, that kind of looked inappropriate, buddy. Hey. Hey. <laughs> oh, man. He did that on purpose. Speak to the vanguard to collect a reward. Anything of interest. Select a reward. Uh, is that our reward there? Nope. Uh, let's see. Practical minded, dismiss philosophy. Dis the practical minded, dismiss philosophy. The scholarly remind them that war is just applied ontology. Okay. Strength plus nine, 30 defense. Grenade hits, restore melee energy. Uh, 24 defense, attune yourself to your field wave. A clean circuit should feel like a good night's rest. Increase reload speed with scout rifles. I don't use scout rifles, so I don't think this one would be a... Yeah. 34 defense, wow. To ignore the city's peril is to sequester oneself from the truth. Pujari, the transcripts. Carry more ammo for pulse rifles. I'm loving the pulse rifle, so I'm thinking that this is going to be it right here. Our, our reward now anything else here we don't have enough glimmer oh look at all this glimmer that we don't have I've got a good feeling about you guardian you got a good feeling about us yay <laughs> I'm sure she says that to everyone though ow Charlie horse Charlie horse ow while I'm sitting down and playing, ow, ow, hold on, ow. ow, while I'm trying to navigate a menu, ow, I'm shaking my leg, ow, ow, gosh, that hurts, that is so horrible, I'm surprised I was able to navigate those menus, Oh, look at all these people. You know what? Let's do this. I'm going to dance. Let's see if we can get them to dance. Dance. Dance with me. Everyone's leaving. Everyone's leaving me. Nobody loves me anymore. All right. Let's go. Uh, yeah, I'm having too much fun in the tower, man. I could probably spend hours here. But I have to get to the story. Now, before my order came in from Amazon, because I'm, I'm too lazy to go to midnight releases. I don't have the time. I have work and stuff like that and I and, and things like that. But uh, I, I was looking up reviews for Destiny, and obviously critics don't necessarily... Ooh, level 8 strike? Nope. Nope. But uh, I was looking up reviews for this, and obviously people... Consumers, users have already put up reviews, and I don't see how you can do that when the game is as new it is as it is and is so massive as it is. I don't see how you can put up a, re a review this soon. But um, according to user reviews, a lot of people are giving this game like zeros and fours and fives. I think they're just I don't I don't know what their deal is, but the Vanguard's reporting that Fallen are tearing into machines all over the Cosmodrome. 
I'm starting to think they aren't just looting the place. Whatever they're looking for, we should probably find it first. Yeah, but they're giving it zeros and stuff. Uh, Metacritic has it around a 4 for Xbox One and a 5 for PS4. And I'm like, no way that this game is that low. I'm picking up heavy fallen activity near the Forgotten Shore. But that's miles from here. Guardian set up a vehicle grid here. We sink to that. We can summon ground transport from our ship. Let's go. So, oh, I think we're going to get our Sparrow here. Yeah. But no way that is this game a, a 5 or a 4. It's a lot of fun. I'm having a lot of fun here. Now, well, you know what I can say? I probably won't have a lot of fun in the PvP, player versus player, because I, I, will, I watched a lot of the beta footage and the alpha footage for the PS4 and the beta for the Xbox One and PS4 and all that stuff. And to be honest, the PvP did kind of seem boring to me. Maybe I just have to get my hands on it myself and I can but now that I have the game myself but oh I guess we can't jump but uh from what I saw from the beta and the alpha PvP just seemed kind of boring to me you know <laughs> this definitely isn't Halo because we don't have our thigh muscles we can't jump so yeah if, if it is as it, when I actually played, if it is as boring to me as uh, it seemed on Twitch and stuff like that, then that that could kind of be a detri detriment. Here's the Sparrow Link. Sparrow Link, yay. <laughs> Encoding superposed states, entangling ket vectors, and we're late. All right. If you want to get your sparrow, we can be in the Forgotten Shore in seconds. A new steed. Oh, by the way, my Xbox color is blue. I love how you can... What do you call it? Blue is my favorite color. And ironically, I do not have a PS4 yet. Oh, jeez. This is just... My body can't handle this. This is so fast. Holy crap. This is way better than a ghost in Halo. Wow, I love it. All right. You know, and a lot of those people who were giving those like zero, four, fives scores already on Metacritic and stuff, think about how much work it takes to program a freaking tree in Destiny or something like that, let alone an entire game, you know what I mean? We're approaching the shore. The Fallen are using some sort of signal amplifiers. Let's see what they're transmitting. I don't know. The, the only way a game deserves zero is if when you turn it, put it into the disc, or, or the, the disc drive, it doesn't turn on. Or I guess now that we're in the next gen, you can download it if you want on release day. But it doesn't turn on. And when you And if it does turn on, it's not a game. It's like, I don't know some kid a video of some kid I don't know doing something something with his stuff or whatever I don't know not like that I'm sorry that that's a bad sort of I'm, I was trying to think of something there but I couldn't and I, I realized how that sounded bad and I I instantly regretted it Then, a game would deserve zero, though. Heck, not even that Aquaman game for the Xbox, the original Xbox, deserves a zero. A one, but not a zero, because it's a game. Alright. I saw you. Don't try to hide from me. Don't walk away from me. Oh, that's one of my favorite songs in uh, Dead Rising 3. I haven't played Dead Rising 3 yet, but I have the soundtrack. Speaking of which, I still have to do the other Dead Risings. I don't know if I'm going to get to them as quick as I wanted to. As quickly as I wanted to, but yeah. He's dead.
looking at my uh please don't talk can I can... give me a second okay some kind of distorted signal not falling let's check the other one I forget what I was gonna oh yeah now these I'm not used to these Xbox one cases anymore like I, I prefer a physical copy of the game because and there's nothing like opening a new disc you know Oh, I just got a new game, and I'm going to open it and put it in my system and play it. Oh, man. It, it's just the best feeling in the world. I may I may get some games digitally, but I love having a physical disc, you know? And, uh... Wh what was I going to say here? But on, on, uh, the, the, I, I'm not used to the Xbox One case at all. It's so... It, I compared it to my 360 case. It's so tiny, dude. And then... The, the game disc is on the left side when you open instead of the right. And there's no game manuals anymore. That was the best part of having a, a game as a kid, you know, when it came with a game manual. But everyone's going eco-friendly and stuff like that, so it, it, it's more efficient to not print out a game manual. And and in games nowadays don't necessarily need it because they kind of cakewalk it for you. They kind of guide, hold your hand and guide you, you know, so you don't necessarily need a game manual. And then we have the wiki, and, and you know, you remember when game manuals used to put a little backstory in them about the game? We have wikis now that have, and we literally have a wiki for almost every popular game. Destiny has its own wiki, Halo has its own wiki, um, World of Warcraft has their own wiki. So if you want to learn stuff about the game, you can pretty much just go online and find it, you know? Detailed articles about your game. The same transmission. Nice. They're both linked to something in Skywatch. Let's check it out. Infiltrate the Skywatch. Can we get our sparrow? Summon vehicle. Yes, please. Oh my gosh, this is this is just so sexy to ride, dude. This is I love the way this drives. Now, if you haven't played Destiny and you're watching this video and you're wondering. Yes, it does control the same to Halo vehicles. Um, you just press up on the left thumbstick, and you turn with the right thumbstick and stuff like that. So it, in that way, it does control similar to Halo vehicles. Oh, jeez. I just realized I'm flaming. Now, now this leads to me to wonder. Can I summon a vehicle when... A new vehicle, or if I summon it again, will it still be flaming? I don't know, but we're gonna walk. Uh, well, you know what? I think we can see, right? Well, let's see. Can we summon again? Um, here we are. Summon vehicle. It appears to be a new vehicle. Yes. 